Bulacan Province. Good evening. Kindly pick the name of your judge. I have eight envelopes here. Thank you, Ms. Nicole and Ms. Catriona. You're very welcome. You have chosen judge, Ms. Margie Moran. Tonight, we have the honor of being joined by the amazing queens of Pinibini, Filipinas. What do you think are the qualities of a Pinibini that sets her apart from other beauty pageant candidates? As Miss Rose Vision Ambassadors for Children, just like my name, Sam, I am a woman of significance, authenticity, and meaning. And because of that, I share the same vision with BPCI, their key partner in nation building, through my advocacy, Harvesting Hope, helping the most vulnerable children in our society overcome poverty. And I think a Pilipinang Pilipinas queen is someone who invites everyone to promote sustainable development, dignity, and social justice, and for the marginalized sector of the community to regain the hope they once had. Thank you. Thank you very much, Pilipini 36. She did not stutter. All right, let's keep the ball rolling with Pilipini 13 from Kalumpit, Bulacan. Good evening, Pilipini 13. Covered in pearls. Can you pick the name of your judge? You have chosen Miss Gloria Diaz. Good evening. Good evening, Miss Gloria Diaz. Number 13. What do you think? What physical asset do you have that should make you win? Bini 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 As a beauty queen and as a woman of vision, I am here to present you the best version of myself despite of having a pivotal losses. Eight days ago, my grandmother died, and I hope, and, and, and I know that she is in heaven watching me and is proud of me that she has the best seat in heaven watching me over. Thank you. What physical asset do you have? What physical asset I have is I am beautiful. Aside from that, I have a mission and vision in life that makes me apart from the other candidates. Thank you. Thank you, candidate number 13. Leave it, it's Gloria Diaz herself to always ask those topic questions and follow up questions with you. Yes, that's all we're done. Alright, Bini Bini 24, it's your turn to step up from Alayo Aduna. Pick the one on top. Here's your microphone. Yeah. Okay. You have chosen judge, Miss Vivi Sharma. Hello, good evening. Hi, good evening. Okay, so number 24, my question for you is, reflecting on the past 60 years, which Bindi Bindi Queen story has inspired, inspired you the most and why? Bini Bini's stories really inspired me as a Venus Rock because we have the same story of coming from a very humble beginning. And as a committed Bini Bini who have high hopes and dreams, I would like to use this platform to inspire, inspire rather, a lot of people who come from humble beginning to push forward, do not limit yourself achieve your dream, whatever it is. And through this effort of mine, I assure the world that I am an empowered Filipina with a glowing heart to inspire, just like a shining diamond. Thank you. Now my question is, if you can speak to the fishermen, 
risking their lives at the West Philippine Sea, what would you tell them? I would tell the fishermen to not lose hope because I trust in our political leaders that they will pursue dialogue over division. And I know that the Philippines will certainly win with just our words. Thank you. Short and sweet. Thank you very much. Hi. The B26. Forward more than half. <laughs> but she handled it incredibly. All right, BDBD32, it's your turn to step up for the Q&A portion. We have chosen our chairwoman of the board, Ms. Pochettina Bernardo. Good evening, ma'am. As we celebrate the legacy of Filipino Filipinas, let me ask you, if you gain the crown tonight, what legacy do you hope to share and be remembered for as a Filipino Filipinas queen? Well, the legacy that I will leave here is my own unique story coming from a province, remote area of Aurora province, trying here, transitioning to province life, to city life, and I'm here trying my best to be the service and to be part of this humanitarian action of Pinipini Pilipinas. And that, that is something that I will leave here in Pinipini Pilipinas as a part of this humanitarian mission of Pinipini Pilipinas. Thank you. Thank you very much, Pinipini 32. Thank you. All right, we're moving right along here, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for being an incredible audience. Let's welcome Pinipini 11 from Kalaohan. Hello, Pinipini 11. Really praying about this one. <laughs> Determines your fate tonight. Thank you so much. Such an honor to be here with you. Oh, thank you. You have chosen Judge Rhea Tan. Hi, Bini Bini of number 11. Good evening, Mama Rhea. I miss you, girls. <laughs> I miss you, girls. Here is your question. If you could have a conversation with any past Bini Bini Filipinas winner who would who will it be, and what advice would you seek from her? It would probably Samantha Bernardo. To be honest, she has taken a huge part of my life joining Bini Bini Filipinas, and it took me 27 years preparing myself, knowing my story and my core values, bringing it up to this stage. And as a woman of action, I am inspired to do the same with my fellow Filipino. As a Philippine Air Force to serve as the Youth Director of Young Men's Christian Association, my main mission is to uplift and inspire the young generation to believe in their own capabilities and talents. And wherever this crown will bring me, I am surely ready for my destiny. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Bini Bini 11. All right, two Bini Binis to go. Let's welcome up Bini Bini 25 from Negros Occidental. Good evening, only two cards left. All right, give it to your Thank you. You have chosen Miss Pia Wurzbach. Oh. Hello, Bini Bini 25. Hello. Cara, okay, here is your question. Where did you spend your childhood and how did your experience there shape your identity? I spent most of my childhood at, at home and that has shaped me to the woman I am right now because it taught me to be myself. As a Bini Bini, I think it's very important to stay true to yourself and your Filipino values because I believe that because I stayed to, true to my core, I am a reflection of a true Bini Bini and that is a woman of purpose a woman of grit and a woman of legacy. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Pini Pini Twenty. Oh, Pini Pini Twenty Five. 
And last but not least, let's welcome Bidi Bidi Ten from Zambales. Hello, so this is the last one. You have chosen our reigning Miss International, Miss Andrea Rubio. Hello, Zambales. Hello. How are you? I feel good. That's nice. Your question is, in an ever-changing world, what is one thing you wish will stay the same, and why? Can you please repeat the question? I, I read that. Sorry. <laughs> in an ever-changing world, what is one thing you wish will stay the same, and why? It would be being empathetic with one another. Because if we have empathy, nothing bad will happen. Adversities will never face because kindness will always stay true. And that is something that we need to do. That is what we need to always have the heart for everyone. Thank you. Thank you very much, PDB. Grace under all this pressure. And when we return, it's time for our, our next seven finalists to get a chance to make their own iconic QA moment. We'll be right back. Beanie, 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 beanie. 